Welcome to Pat's Picks. This is the Futures Trading Challenge. Thanks so much for coming by. Today is episode six, and I am very happy to say the account is green today. I think I made seven, no, I made eight trades. Sorry, I don't have it written down in front of me like the options. So trying to do it a little bit different format, um, and I don't want to overwork myself with adding all the extra notes, especially when it tracks it for me. So anyways, it was a nice green day. As you can see here, this is just a chart. Nothing really to look at except for, you know, the chart for the day. But let's take a look at the performance center and we can go over the stats for the day. All right, you can see gross P&L 300, total profit 375. Uh, I made seven trades today. Oh, sorry, eight trades today, one loss. So really, really happy about the accuracy. You know, just being patient, waiting for those right setups. You know, I'm trading it the exact same way I trade my options. Um, and it's just timing is everything and being patient. So you can see here accuracy for the day 87% and you can also see the P&L history for the day which is cool. Um, if you've never seen that before, hey this kind of looks like a cactus. Um, if you've never seen that before it really it tracks you know the exact time of day and when the losses were and then below it breaks it down kind of differently. You know cumulative without fees with fees so I made $300 without fees, $263 with the fees taken out um, and you can see the distribution which is kind of cool you know the biggest loss 75 biggest win 200 uh, and these are all the trades for the time and day so um, what's cool about all this information though is when you look at all the trades together and you can kind of get that that uh, data all at once it can really be helpful it might give you a little bit of an edge and just kind of let you know what time of day works best for you when do you make the most money you know and over time just getting that large amount of information uh, can be extremely helpful um, but down here you can see all the trades oh this I thought was really cool so the last trade of the day was only five seconds I literally entered this order and it took profit in five seconds and I made $75 in five seconds I think that's a new record for the channel so wow I was like holy cow I didn't even realize at the time you know I, I knew it triggered fast but I didn't know it was that fast so five seconds you know new land speed record uh, if someone has a faster trade I would love to see it if someone's made more than seventy five dollars in five seconds please share a screenshot because that's just crazy um, but I'm sure someone has I'm not saying no one has done that before but it is pretty wild to see and that's the beauty of having that automatic stop loss take profit order right there you know sometimes it can suck if it stops you out um, but if you're patient and you're waiting for that right setup you know the odds are in your favor and so that's really just what happened right there so that end of day move as you can see over here on Weeble um, I basically took that trade right around here so it just boom it just ripped so anyways um, let's just take a look at all the data combined you know, there's not too much to go over on this futures account. I'm still, you know, obviously learning and trying to get the hang of it. So if you guys have any questions, uh, I'm happy to help. Obviously, I don't know everything, but if I don't know the answer, you know, I'm happy to look it up so uh, we can all learn together. Um, what am I looking for here? Custom range. I guess I can't think and talk at the same time. Oh, boy. Okay, so from... <laughs> Uh, okay, here we go. So from the start of this challenge, which was three trading days, I've made 27 trades, 23 of them were green, four losses, you know, total profit 1175, total loss 400. Um, but it's really cool once you, you know, you get more information and more data in here, you can see how it all kind of plays out for you. Um, and you can see like this starting off red, battling out that first day and then that day turning green and then just building on top of it. It's just cool to see it all. And that P&L per time of day is pretty cool to see. As you can see, 9 o'clock is my best time to trade with 400. And then the worst time for me is basically right in the morning with <laughs> minus 112. So I guess from that I take, hey, wait until uh, the market plays out a little bit. Don't trade that first morning drop or spike, whatever it might be. Um, which is what I like to do anyways because I know that's what works best for me. So, you know, wait in that first 15, 30 minutes, wait for that trend to play out, and then ride that wave. That's really really the motto around here. Um, but I think that's all I have to have to say or share. If you guys have any questions, like I said, happy to help. Um, but I'm going to try to keep these videos, you know, a little sweeter, a little shorter than the options because making two a day is just is wild. So, anyways, hope you stay happy and healthy. I'll see you tomorrow.